Hey guys, Casey with Top Branch. One of the best investments we've ever made. Our ground protection mats. One of the reasons why ground protection mats is one of the best investments we made is because it lengthened our season. It made it so that way we could work uh, more days a year. We don't have to dance around the weather. And it made it so that way we have a higher quality uh, finished job when we get done. Most clients don't care how you do the job, how you take the trees down or what you have to do. They only care what it looks like at the very end. And that was the most important thing to us. They come in four by eight sheets or three by eight sheets. And we ended up going with the three by eights because they're just a little bit lighter. They store super well in the flatbed. So wherever the flatbed goes, wherever the machine goes, those mats, they end up going with us. They come in two different textures. The machine one, one with a larger tread, sometimes uh, during the end of the day, you, your, your feet don't pick up quite as easy and it's easier to trip on them, but it gives a little bit more grip for a larger machine or anything like that. For pedestrian wise, the, the pedestrian one definitely is, is worth its weight. These things are super durable. They're half inch thick and they can support like 60 tons. So uh, we've used them on cranes. We've used them for uh, fall protection, for putting putting trees across people's lawns to keep the divots down, backing, putting material on people's lawns when you're coming off the pavement onto, onto the grass right there. It, it made it so you wouldn't, you couldn't even tell that there was a whole entire 18, uh, 18 yards of topsoil being delivered to a client's, uh, to a, one of our client's house when, uh, when these mats were down. But as soon as we didn't have the mats down or he got off of them, it wasn't a pretty sight. They have super nice handles on, on all four sides. Plus they have little holes for putting pins into the ground to keep the mats from shifting. If you end up putting landscape stakes into the uh, in the ground through these holes, it makes it so it holds them down super nice and tight. They don't go anywhere, they don't walk. Plus, being a little white allows for the vegetation to still get a little bit of uh, sunlight to photosynthesize so it doesn't hurt the the grass or burn the grass like a black one would because the black one's going to heat right up. These translucent ones, we, we thought were probably a better a better investment if they had to stay on a lawn for any length of time so that way we didn't have dead patches of grass later. They come in like a 30 rack. <laughs> they come in they come in a pallet of 30 a lot of times and we just ended up ordering a whole entire pallet of 30. And it goes about, if you were to double them up, it goes about probably 200 feet or so. So you can easily go the most length of, of our jobs. A lot of times you're not that far from pavement or anything like that. So we, we usually do like 16 on a trailer and then the other, the other part is on at our, at, our, uh, at our yard so if we need it we just bring that extra pallet but a lot of times the, we got 16 of them or so live on the trailer and being three foot wide a mini skid steer fits right on top of them super easily you can utilize them with big machines little machines even if you're going across a bunch of mud and you want to keep the limbs dry and not having a lot of uh, mud and gravel on them so when you put them in the chipper it's dull on your knives quicker that's what we've also used them too that way we're not just saying that they're rugged we've tested them Oh, a couple things that I actually forgot. These guys actually come with a lifetime warranty, so you don't have to be scared about actually using them. And if it makes you feel any better, they're 100% recyclable. We ended up getting these guys at Green Pond Environmental, and it was, it's been one of the best experiences for buying something like this uh, that I've had so far. But for, for us, I always keep asking myself, how do we do this without them? <laughs> Well guys, if you like this kind of review stuff, uh, I'll leave that in the comment section below. Subscribe so that way whenever we do more of these reviews or any more videos to come up, you'll be the first one to know about it. Thanks guys, appreciate it. We'll see you guys on the next one.